Hi there, I'm meteorologist Katie Blake. Hope you've had a great Saturday so far. Thanks so much for stopping by for a quick forecast update. Tonight's will be a cold night. Temperatures will start to fall into the 40s quickly after the sun goes down upper 30s by midnight. So if you've got plans, you will want a jacket or a coat. That's for sure. Thankfully, unlike last night, winds will be light. It's light winds, also very dry air and clear skies overnight that will set us up for another round of widespread freezing temperatures across the KSAP viewing area, mid 20s across the hill country, low 30s for your morning lows as far south as Catula and Beeville. So Sunday will start cold, but a lot of us will be closer to 70 tomorrow afternoon with a nice south breeze, 10 to 20 miles per hour. Don't forget tonight we spring forward. This is the one where we lose an hour of sleep, but this puts our sunrise and sunset times about an hour later beginning on Sunday. So time change coming tonight on Monday evening, Monday nights, a uh, cold front will come through. This is a Pacific cold front, so notice our afternoon highs don't change much a few degrees. Yes, but this will really just help to keep humidity low. However, there will be a chance for a quick hitting shower or non severe storm Monday night, especially areas east of I 35 as that Pacific cold front comes on through Tuesday, Wednesday, beautiful days, a few more clouds and a bit warmer on Thursday for St. Patrick's Day, and then another Pacific cold front will slide through Thursday into Friday to keep humidity low heading into next weekend.